In today's video, we will be discussing about the most important and advanced research tools that make your research writing easy. Let's go to the first one, which is data analyzers and graphing tools. When we talk about data analyzers and graphing tools, it must be user friendly and it must be simple in nature and the softwares must be incapable of producing different graphs easily. If you want to produce more graphs with more attractive, I recommend you to use origin software. This is the interface of an origin software in which you can make several and different type of graphs with different designs. There are many options that you can change the color of your graph and input your data and you can produce different graphs sequentially. There are several worksheets are there in which you can input your XY data and you can produce several graphs. You can able to export all the graphs in your required format like JPEG, PNG etc. Let us move towards the second category which is research writing. When we talk about research writing there are two important parameters are there which is plagiarism and grammar. Plagiarism is an act of copying someone else ideas or the act of copying our own. If I am publishing or writing one, two and three research papers and I am writing the fourth one. If I copied the third one and write in the fourth one, it is called as plagiarism. It is also called as a self plagiarism. And the second important parameter is grammar. A grammar check must be required for a research article. It is a mandatory thing for your research article. If I am committing self plagiarism or any other plagiarism, to get better words or better content, you may use paraphraser. A paraphraser will give you a similar meaning with the extra extraordinary words. For checking plagiarism, there are several tools available in the market. Here I have listed some of the tools. You can go with Turnitin, Urkund, Authenticate, Plagiarism Checker, etc. Turnitin, Urkan and Authenticate are the most importantly used softwares in universities. For grammar checking for researchers, there are many softwares available all over the web and App Store, Play Store, etc. So, here there are some example softwares is displayed like Grammarly, Ginger are the most familiar softwares used for grammar checking. For grammar checking, I will recommend you to use Grammarly, which is the most familiar software and it is used most of the universities in India. The purpose of paraphrase is to convey the meaning of the original message and in doing so, to prove that you understand the passage well enough to restate. Here there are some of the best paraphrasing softwares is listed here. Quailboard Premium, Plagiarism Director, Paraphrase Online, Dupli Checker, Clever Spinner, Spin Rewriter, Wordtune, sorry, Wordtune, Paraphrasing.io. Okay, Quailboard Premium. I will recommend this software for paraphrasing which is the best software and it is used by most of the universities and researchers all over the world. Quillbrot Premium is not a free software but it is more effective. For academic writing you can use refer and write software for paraphrasing. It has a paraphrasing option but it, its accuracy is very low. 
but this of software has many other options and also it has a best option called a search option which helps you to find the self plagiarism if you had copied the same content or committed in plagiarism it can help you to search it and find it but you have to upload or register all the previous research papers that you had done so that you can able to find the plagiarism done by you matlab is also a best software for solving complex problems numerical equations etc it can be also used for statistical analysis and the fourth thing is formatting we commonly use microsoft word google docs for formatting text paragraphs and documents i recommend latex for formatting documents which is a document preparation system and the last thing is scientific images researchers can use most of the softwares like adobe photoshop canva corel draw etc if you like my video please subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon